the spirit of our ancestors festival is a day is set aside to commemorate the descendants of the Clotilda. There were festivals um, that started back in the 80s from the original founders of the Descendants Association. And um, I guess it stopped for a while. So um, I decided to start it up again. And um, I was reading Dr. Natalie Robinson's book, The Slave Ship Clotilda and the Makings of Africa Town, Spirit of Our Ancestors. So that's how I came up with the title. How did you come up with your program? Growing up here in Africa Town and attending Union Missionary Baptist Church, there was a bust of Cudjo Lewis in front of our church all of my life. And back in 2002, that bus was destroyed by some kids that, you know, there's some kids acting up and they just decided to vandalize. And later they put up a historical marker. And this historical marker had the founders of Union Baptist Church. And there were several names on there. And growing up, we I always heard about Kudja Lewis, but not the others. So I was like, hmm, that's pretty interesting that there, there were these other founders. So I asked around the church, you know, I knew that there were other descendants. So I asked around and, you know, I wanted to hear more stories about their ancestors. So when I decided to form this program, I wanted them to share their story. Hello, everyone. My name is Claudia Dale Kibi. Yes, I am a Kibi, and I am so blessed to be a Kibi. Thank you so much for asking me to speak here. Thank you, Cousin Ked, for giving me a call. Asa Kibi was one of the founders of Africa Town. He was one of many uh, young Africans who were snatched from their homeland and forcibly uh, brought over uh, on this side. He was very knowledgeable in roots. So uh, when anyone got ill, they called on Asakibi because he knew exactly what root for what ailment. I could go on and on about Asa, but what I really want to touch bases on and speak to the young people is that we are the voice of Asakibi. Uh, I used to ask Joycelyn, talk to Joycelyn about the voice, his voice getting lost, but his voice isn't lost. I'm his voice. Every Kibi sitting here is Asa's voice. We are the seed of Asa. We have greatness in us. Can you imagine what it was like for him to be brought from his homeland and taken to a strange land and having to start all over and, and start from nothing? It took courage. It took um, championship. And that is the heritage that we have in our bloodline. It is a blessing to have that blood flowing through your veins.